for a bit.
Hey, Gearsy! Uh, Uzume? It's been a while. Man, I never thought we'd get to see each other again so fast. Freeze, bitch. Uh -huh. Don't give us that crap about missing Netgear. We're not here to play. Uh, hey now, am I missing something? Hey, she's your pal, right, Gearsy? Could you tell her to point her piece somewhere else? Uh... Gearsy? We won't be fooled. You may have caught our sisters off guard with that routine, but that's not gonna work on us. We're too smart for that. Please, Uzume. Please return Neptune and the others. How... how could you even do this? Hold up. What the hell are you saying? Return Nepsi? I haven't even seen her since you all left. That's a lie! We saw you use that dark CPU or whatever to take our sisters away. If you're just gonna play like that, I won't hesitate to shoot you. Yeah, that's right! Give back our sisters! Give them back! Did you say dark CPU just now? What? what Stop playing stupid! If you move, I'll shoot! Shoot me, I don't care. But first, you gotta tell me everything you know about the dark CPU. <laughs> Wait, Yuni! You too, Uzume! Nepgear? Yuni, lower your weapon. But she... Please. I think it'll be okay. All right. I was happy to see you again, Gearsy, but then all this happened. This is so messed up. I'm sorry, Uzume. You must have your reasons. Can you at least tell me what's going on? <laughs> I see. I get what's going on now. I can't believe that purple witch is still kicking. And what in the world would Big Nepsy be doing with her anyway? It really wasn't you, right? I keep telling you that you've got it wrong, right? I don't even know how to get over there. If I could get over there, I would have hopped on over to Nepsy's place to hang out. This is just a hunch, but maybe the person who kidnapped Nep and the others is an imposter. But the girl we saw knew Nepgear by name. She even knew Uzume's nickname for her, and seemed very familiar with her. This is getting more and more mysterious. My head is getting all muddled. I have a question for you all next. The person you met was with the dark CPU, right? Yeah. It was what kidnapped our sisters. There's no mistake. I see. It seems like the dark CPU appearing again wasn't just some rumor. A rumor? What do you mean? Last night, one of the baby bugs supposedly saw the dark CPU, or so he said. At first I thought he might have been half asleep and was hallucinating, but Goobs and the other monsters said they saw it too. Then, while doing some reconnaissance, Umio said he saw Gearsy and the others, and so here we are. So, that's what happened. Then, who was that other Uzume that Yuni and I saw? Well, it's clear now! Like I have said, it has to be an imposter sent to catch our sisters off guard! It's probably best both Gear and Uzume stay alert and be careful. With one mistake, you could have done each other in. We can't completely rule out that was the fake's plan, either. Um, Uzume, by the way, I haven't seen Umio yet. What's going on? Umio's gone to talk to the monsters that saw the dark CPU. We plan to meet up here, so any minute now, he... Sorry to keep you waiting, Uzume. Ah, it's been a while, Gearsy. Oh, Nepsi didn't accompany you, it seems. Something appeared? A fish with a human face? Hmm, is he a white fish? Roasting whole is good, but Munier seems like it did go well with it, too. Oh. Creepy. Umio, I've got some bad news. I see. If that is truly the case, it's not too surprising. Do you know something? I've not confirmed the hole that connects dimensions, but in this world, there were multiple reports last night of the dark CPU. From piecing together the various times it was spotted by witnesses, it seems the dark CPU and a fake Uzume flew northeast from here. Northeast, is it? Uzume, is there something in the northeast? There's literally nothing over there. 
the earth and the land's all gone, there's only void. But why there? Uzume, this incident may have some connection to that phenomenon. We should accompany them. Of course, that was my intention from the start. If Nepsi got kidnapped in this world, it's the perfect time to return my debt. There you have it, Gearzy. We'll be cruising along with you. Thank you. There's a lot of things I still don't know about this world, so I'm relieved you'll be joining us, Uzume. Going here? I'll rest for a bit. Guess I have no choice. That one's the time next to save target. the world. Yeah. Target Let's neutralized. Oh. I, what did I do? Wait, I did Enough it. boasting. Come at me. I will never be. That one's the next target. There. Target neutralized. How was that? That's my re. Here. 
I'll show you the power of last station CPU cannony! I'll do my best! Here we go! Leave this to me! I'm sorry! Keep your eyes front! I'll watch the rear! Got you! Here, here! Hey, hey! I'll end this gracefully! Fire! Fire! I will easy. never be a memory. I'll do my best. I what should I do? I got one! Yay! This is amazing! Here?
We have arrived. This is the end of the world. There really isn't anything here. But our sisters are somewhere ahead. How are we supposed to go through? What are we supposed to walk on? What should we do, Uzume? Crap! Everyone, grab onto something! Anything! Ah! What's shaking? It's really shaking! Ah! That was really shocking. What was that? I knew it. What's going on? Could it possibly have something to do with the phenomenon Umio mentioned earlier? Oh, right. We hadn't informed you yet. Gearzy, take a look at this screen. These numbers? Dimensional coordinates? That's right. A little while after you guys left, a ton of quakes started popping up all around Zero Dimension. While I was using the visual radio you modified to check out what was going on, we realized the numbers were changing, just a little bit. Please, wait a second! Did those numbers really change? What do you mean? I said this before, but that number stands for Zero Dimension's coordinates within multidimensional space. A Dimension's coordinates are usually an absolute number, and they should never ever change. But if those numbers have been changing, then that means the Dimension itself has been moving its position. For real? But how the hell can it move? And where is it headed? Wait one sec. That number looks familiar. I think it was... Oh no. It can't be. These are Hyper Dimension's coordinates. Zero Dimension's previous coordinates were... And Zero Dimension's current coordinates are... It's slow, but it's getting closer to our world. Wh what happens when it reaches it? I... don't know. It's just not possible for a Dimension's coordinates to change. That just doesn't happen. Well, it's happening. Man, what the hell is going on with Zero Dimension? Hey! What happened with your memory loss? Oh, that. Yeah, I gotta give thanks to the fact I can gain shares from monsters now. I've been remembering things little by little. Only, it's been things like going door to door with a wagon to sell a new game console I made. Or just when I thought sales were picking up, not being able to produce enough and having to apologize. Useless memories like that. But even with those seemingly unimportant memories, it's great you're regaining them. Yeah, you're right. But I'd really like to remember the name of my own nation already. Planetune. Huh? Planetune. That's the name of your... No, the name of my nation. That form! You're... me? Yoo-hoo! Nepgear! We meet again. How have you been? Neptune! <laughs> nice to meet you, me. This is our first encounter, face to face. I don't know who you are, but that's the name of Gearzy's nation. Don't mess with me. Gearzy's nation can be traced back to your own nation, me. It's very simple. What do you mean? That's something I will have to remember, along with what Planetune did to you. What the hell do you know? I know everything you don't. Yes, for example, I even know what happens when two dimensions end up with the same coordinates. I'll tell you, it's a freebie. When that happens, those two dimensions will fuse together, forming one single dimension. See? Isn't it a simple solution? Although, tragically, of course, hyperdimension will only transform to be like zero dimension. So, you're the one who's behind Nepsi's kidnapping and the dark CPU! What the hell are you planning? Sorry, but I can't answer that yet. Besides, I came for something entirely different. Gearzy, could you hand over the game console you stole from Affymax? What's your objective? It's not very courteous of you to answer my question with a question. All you need to do is hand that console over to me. You're the one who's been controlling Affymojas and Gold Third, aren't you? Wow, how very smart. Yes, you're right. I suppose that's to be expected from one of Planetune's intelligence agents. I don't know what you're planning, but I'm not giving you the console! Oh well. It'll take some effort, but I can just recover it later. Let's return, Neptune. Wait! Why did you kidnap our sisters? 
Please, return them immediately! Oh, that's right. But I'll return them only when the time has come. They're turning out quite nicely. I'm looking very forward to it. Wait! Nepgear, let's hurry after them. We can't let our only lead escape. 